First and foremost, I want to give all honor, praises, and glory to the Most High Yahweh. Also to the true King of Kings, the true Black Messiah, Yahweh Shah. Also to the founding fathers of the truth out of one West. This fallen king is coming right back at you with this truth. The name of this class is going to be the King of Kings. For the do, let me get the scriptures. It's the book of um, Exodus 15, verse 3. It says, The Lord is a man of war. The Lord is his name. When the Lord returns, he's going to bring mass destruction on all his enemies and all those who oppose his truth. For the do, I'm gonna get a second verse. This is the book of um, this is book of um, Habakkuk three and verse sixteen. It says, "When I heard my belly tremble, my lip quivered at the voice of rottenness entered into my bones." This prophet, when he seen the destruction of this place, it was rottenness entered into his bones. I trembled in myself that I might rest in the day of trouble. When he cometh up unto them. He will invade them with his truth. I'm talking about supernatural beings going to come down and invade this place with their troops. All praise and honor to the Most High, Yahweh, and Holy Person, Son, the King of Kings, Yahweh Shah. Yahweh Shah is going to come with his army and invade this place with his troops. So, Father, let me get a second verse. This is the book of Isaiah 63. Who is this that coming from Edom? With Dog Garment from Basra? If you know who Edom is, <laughs> look at the back of your dollar. This is, this is that is glorious in his apparel, traveling the greatness of his strength. I, it, it's the Lord speaking. I that speak in right is might, mighty to save. Wherefore art thou red in our pairs? Thy garment like him that treaded in the wild fact. When the Lord returned, his garment will be, 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 be covered in blood. I have, tro I have tried it, this the Lord answer. I have trotted the wine press alone, and of the people there was none with me. Many he didn't need no help when he did this thing. For I would tread them in my anger and trample them with my fury, and their blood should be sprinkled upon my garden, and I would stain with all my raiments. For the day of vengeance in my heart, and the year of my redeem is come. It's gonna be we got a Pacific year, we're gonna get out of here. And I looked, and there was none to help. I wondered that there was none to uphold. Therefore, my own arm, therefore, my own arm brought salvation unto me, and my fury upheld me. When the Lord returned, he's gonna have so much anger, his fury is gonna upheld him. I will tread down the people in my anger, and my and make them drunk in my fury, and I will bring their strength down to the earth. That's all their airplanes, their aircraft, this supernatural force, them cherries in the skies, it, it, they're gonna bring. Anything of made man, of man made, is going to be brought to the ground. And I will mention the love and kindness of the Lord and out the praise of, of the Lord according to all the Lord have bestowed upon us, which is us. Who is us, the children of Israel? Let me get the second verse real quick. Another precept. Shalawar. This is the book of, it's a book of Revelation. And, and he had a vesture on him. His thigh name written, the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. The Lord return, he will get his glory, he will get his honor. All praise and honor to the Most High Yahweh, his Holy Spirit, the Son, Yahweh Shah. This is Fallen Kings coming right back at you with this truth. Nothing stopped. This truth gonna go on forever with or without me. 
You feel me? This truth gonna go on forever, man. Fallen kings, man. Forever, man. Fallen kings. All praise and honor to the most high, Yahweh. Hopefully, I'm among the hopeful elect in the nation of Israel. All honor, praise, and glory to the most high, Yahweh.